The question says equivalent weight of H3PO2 when it disproportionates into PH3 and H3PO3 is okay. Molecular weight of H3PO2 is given M. Okay. You can see a disproportionate redox reaction is taking place. Disproportionate redox reaction is a reaction in which a single element undergoes both oxidation as well as reduction reaction. Okay, first of all, we write down the chemical reaction. The chemical reaction we have as 3 po 2 as 3 po 2 is disproportionating into pH3 and plus we have as 3 and PO3 is there. There the chemical reaction taking place. Okay, we have to calculate equivalent weight for the substance as 3 po 2 formula for the equivalent we have equivalent weight is equal to molecular weight divided by n factor molecular weight we have m already given there in the question if we calculate n factor value we can answer this question and n factor value we can calculate we can calculate by using this equation and always keep in mind to calculate n factor value for disproportionate to dog section we have different way of calculating n factor value first of all we write down the oxidation number 2 to the 4, 3 hydrogen is there. Phosphorus is present in plus 1 oxidation numbers. Okay. Each hydrogen is what plus 1. There are 3 hydrogen, then phosphorus is present in minus 3 oxidation numbers. 3 to the 6, 3 hydrogen are there, then phosphorus is present in plus 3 oxidation numbers. Now pay attention carefully. We can compare the oxidation number. Phosphorus to phosphorus, you can see decrease in oxidation numbers. Plus 1 to minus 3 decrease in oxidation number. Decrease in oxidation number is always reduction. And increase in oxidation number is always oxidation. Okay. Always oxidation. So this is what a reduction reaction means. We have gain of electron. Okay. Find the difference in oxidation numbers. We have plus 1. This is what a minus 3. So plus 1 minus minus 3 is equal to 4 electron. We have 4 electron. Okay. Then again, phosphorus to phosphorus in this case. Plus 1, 2, plus 3 is there. Plus 1, 2, plus 3. You can see in this case, increase in oxidation number means oxidation. You can see same element. A single element is undergoing both oxidation as well as reduction reaction. Find the difference in oxidation number. 3 minus 1 is equal to 2 electron is there. 2 electron. Okay. Now we got the trans. You can see loss of electron as well as gain of electron is there. Now we can apply the formula to calculate n factor value. The formula we have n factor is equal to n1 multiplied by n2 divided by n1 plus n2. This formula we use to calculate n factor value in a disproportionate redox reaction. Okay. So I assume it is what n1. This is what n2 is there. It is n2. Plug in the values. We have 4 multiplied by 2 divided by 4 plus 2 is there. We got 8 by 6 is there. If you simplify, so we get 4 by 3 is there. 4 by 3. N factor value for H3PO2 is what? 4 by 3 is there. Okay. Molecular weight given M. So we can plug in here. It is M divided by 4 by 3. 3 will go at the top. So we can write 3M by 4 is there. Any such option? 3M by 4. You can see B option is correct. Very interesting question. Okay. Option B is correct.